Hi, I'm Kelly Moran, here at the Inner Space Center. Our facility at the University of Rhode Island is home to an exciting new project based on a special capability of our ship, telepresence. While we always have scientists on shore, for most of our legs, the big decisions come from the ship. For this cruise, called Inspire, all that changes. The lead scientists and data loggers are right here on shore. They'll be on comms with the ship, directing ROV operations, picking our targets, and analyzing the data as it comes in. Why put scientists on shore? Bunk space is valuable on Nautilus. 48 beds seems like a lot, but by the time you fill them up with the crew, the operations team, and the mappers, there aren't many spots left. Telepresence frees us from the space constraints of the ship, allowing more scientists to be involved with the expedition. Dr. Ballard, the founder and president of the Ocean Exploration Trust, has been using telepresence to revolutionize science for decades. It's the same technology we use to bring you all of the amazing ocean videos you see on our website and streaming in museums, aquaria, schools, and universities around the world. This technology isn't just used by the public. Scientists join our expedition from home, identifying sea creatures, pointing out interesting finds, helping us with archaeological studies, and more. We've even made discoveries based on viewer input. Remember our visit to an unknown shipwreck earlier this year? A viewer first identified the class of vessel, leading to our eventual discovery that the target was the USS Peterson. So how does telepresence work? Our video streams from the cameras on Hercules and Argus up our fiber optic cable to the control van on Nautilus, where it is sent via an advanced satellite system to the Inner Space Center. From here, it is distributed directly to scientists' computers and to the web. We've been changing the way ocean science has been done for years, and this latest venture is an exciting step forward in scientific collaboration. During our trip to Kikum Jenny Volcano and Trinidad Mud Volcanoes, keep an ear out on the science chat for a few extra voices. Our shore team will be participating and answering questions along with our usual team on the ship. It's sure to be an exciting crew, so tune in to nautiluslive.org to experience it all with us.